6.30 in the morning. I'm about to head into work. I'll work until 3.30 in the afternoon. And then, for the next two hours, I'll sit around in the cafe, probably work on some writing, and do some editing, and wait for a ride home, because I don't want to pay a fortune for a taxi. So I won't walk in the door until probably 5.30 tonight. I do this about two to three times a week. These days are insanely long and I'm always exhausted by the end of it. started as a, oh, I'm not feeling the greatest today, um, kind of cold has turned into full-on sinus, foggy head, sore throat cough, all of the, like, quintessential cold symptoms, like the stuff that you see in cold medicine commercials. That is what I have right now, and I'm insanely <laughs> bummed about it like so bummed out. I have so many things I need to get done and want to get done. I have a lot of like, I don't know, even last night I couldn't sleep because I had all of these things going in my head of all of the shit I wanted to do. And like, I even just tried to get up to use the bathroom just then and I was just so tired. So tired and like wheezy. Uh, so I think I'm just gonna sit on my bed and make lists because at least then I'll feel like I'm accomplishing something. It's 7.13. I'm going to try and stay awake until at least 9 or 9.30. And then I have another long day tomorrow. Another 7 to 3. And then staying at the cafe until 5.30. <coughs> uh, but then tomorrow I'm hanging out with my friend Julie. So that'll break up the monotony of work. Hopefully I'm feeling better by then. Actually, I think I'm Julie's the one who gave me this illness, so whatever. I'm not just popping it. Actually, I don't think I popped it a single time. 